Today, we're gonna work on painting it, and if we can get it dry by this evening, we'll go ahead and clear coat it, and the hand of glory will be done. <laughs> Hey guys, so we are on to day four. Um, it is done. I was gonna go ahead and start painting it last night, but I wanted to give it a few more hours to dry. So here's where we're at. It is completely coated in the two ply napkins. All the nails are on. All of the details are there. We've got all the little wrinkles going down the wrist. Again, we've got the wedge in the hand here. The knuckles are all done. You can see some of that texture really good right here. As well as on that one there. So, it's looking really good. I am gonna go ahead and try to give these cuticles one more pushback just to make sure that they've got some really good de uh, detail to them. Make sure you keep watching because at the end of this are some pretty fun little um, bloopers and some silliness that we threw in here for you guys just for a laugh. We're gonna get to painting. I'm gonna go ahead and time lapse that for you guys. I will say that since this is not, it's a little more muscular um, and not as decayed as the hand in Harry Potter. Um, so I think I'm gonna do my own thing when it comes to painting it and just go with what feels right on this one um, because I'm not selling it. Um, it is just a fun piece for our collection, so I'm just going to have some fun with it and see what happens. So stick around, see what you guys think. If I have any tips or tricks I, you know, have to throw in there, I will come back to the regular video and let you guys know about that. Otherwise, I'll probably just time lapse through the entire paint job and we'll say our goodbyes at the end. So thanks for sticking it out this far. Please, 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 if you enjoyed this video so far, don't forget to give us a, a thumbs up or a like. Um, it really, really helps to push our channel in the YouTube algorithm and push it for other people who are interested in projects like this. Um, also, while you're down there giving us a thumbs up, if you wouldn't mind and you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. Right directly next to the subscription button is a little bell icon. I'll show you guys an image of that right here. Um, but there's a bell icon, and if you'll click on that, it will notify you every single time that we upload a new video. Um, just so that you know, you know when we have stuff coming out, and we cover all kinds of things, guys, from home decor to fun, you know, random pieces like this. Um, we're also working on our schoolie remodel. We've got a cellar remodel coming up. Um, we do, you name it, remodel, decor, um, quick tricks and tips on how to make your life a little easier. Um, so, yeah, we're just a, a family-friendly channel, and we always, always try to keep it friendly for everybody. So, come join the family. We'd love to have you guys.
Okay guys, the hand is done. It has several colors throughout it. I plan to leave you guys a list of all of the supplies and materials that I used. So you'll have that down in the description box below. And I painted, I have a black quick dry nail polish and I like the black nails. However, I don't love the shine. Chuck says it really sets it off, but I think it's just a bit much. So I'm gonna try to kind of dull that back just a hair because I think having the shiny nails just kind of makes it look too fake. So unless this is just, you know, one really stylish monster. It definitely needs to have those nails dulled back just a hair. So anyway, again with the details, you can see all the wrinkles now really, really good. All the texture, everything stands out real well. So super huge monster claw. done and it stands on its face really well <clears throat> so everything looks really nice and clean so anyway you guys thanks so much for watching um, please leave us a comment below if you think this project was fun or if you feel like you might try your hand at it I would love to hear how yours goes, what colors you chose to use, um, if you use the spiky nails, <laughs> whatever, I'd love to hear about it. So, um, again, if you like this kind of stuff and this interests you, then do us a favor and remember to subscribe for more videos. And while you're down there, click the bell so that YouTube will notify you of future videos. And if you liked this particular piece, give us a thumbs up. If you didn't, give us a thumbs down. That works too. Um, but thanks again for watching, guys, and we will see you in the next one. Bye! Mom, I got you a snack for our Harry Potter movie marathon. Aw, thank you.
<clears throat> Those are mine. Thank you. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and sticking it out with me. Um, it was a lot of fun. And from what I understand, the girls say that I definitely beat this challenge. So looking forward to the next one. And if I do anything else, I'll get that posted too. But as for now, I am in the mood for a Harry Potter movie and one of my favorite snacks. Gummy bears sound amazing right now. Oh, thank you so much. Bye, guys.